I am going to cover this engine control console. So right now the engine is running and uh, what are the equipments which are there and how we monitor them. So we will start and uh, see what things are there. This part is your engine control console. So here you will see two sets of alarm monitoring panel. CPU are below over there and the screen is over here. So with the help of mouse and keyboard we can control uh, the alarms and other parameters. Next to this alarm monitoring panel you will find uh, these three units which is for the main engine. This is the governor control unit and this is the remote control system for main engine only and this is the safety system for main engine. So all the alarms connected for slowdown, shutdown connected with this unit. So if, you, if I talk about any alarms which is there in main engine, it is connected to this safety unit, safety system unit and this is the RPM which is giving right now for the main engine. This is the remote control unit which is connecting your bridge to this unit so that uh, with the help of the same lever which is there on the bridge they are able to control the engine so we will give the indication right now it is running set point limiter start fail block so engine not trading system warning system fail so whatever if there is no communication or any block is there in the engine this unit is going to help you and give you the alarm so that you can rectify the problem if you find if you face any problem you can see the symbol ahead rotation this unit is your governor unit so governor is the one which is controlling the fuel and we, according to the fuel the main engine is giving is rotating so this unit is is controlling your governor top you will find clock and this is this number one steering gear alarms number two steering gear alarm and few of the indication for running machineries you can see here if number number one is running number one low wall purifier running number one HFO purifier running and the fresh water generator this unit is your speed log indication whatever the speed right now the ship is giving is indicating over here and this is the radar angle indicator so this is just a repeater the main unit is on the bridge repeater you will find in uh, maneuvering platform also and on bridge port and starboard this is your fuel pump mark indicator so this is the this is the one which is indicating how much percentage of uh, the fuel rack is pressed this is your main and rpm indicator whatever right now because of rough weather the fluctuation is too much and this is your turbocharger rpm indicator main engine revolution counter main engine is right now running in hfo so it, the hfo indication is indicating it this side you will see main engine starting air inlet indication, main engine fuel oil inlet pressure, main engine control air inlet pressure, main engine jacket cooling fresh water inlet pressure, main engine scavenger air inlet pressure, main engine cooling sea water inlet pressure, main engine lube oil inlet pressure, fire main line, right now it is a stop, boiler steam pressure indicator, composite boiler steam pressure indicator. Uh, boil, main boiler and composite boiler water level indicator and this main and fuel oil viscosity and generator fuel oil viscosity and this is the changeover indication for number 1, number 2 and number 3 DG this is your oil misdirector unit I have made a separate video on this you can check that this is for the protection of uh, main engine so in case of crankcase fire, this unit is going to uh, give the alarm and shut down. 
so you can see here this is a slowdown oil mess reduction and non cancellable so you will find few of the items which shut down which are cancellable all these are cancellable this one is non cancellable these are cancellable so these alarm you can cancel but these few alarms this is this is oil mess non cancellable and main engine low oil inlet pressure this is non cancellable other alarms you can uh, press this cancel button and cancel them and you can run the main engine but once these alarm are activated you you will not be able to run it any anyhow you have to stop the engine and then rectify the problem kitty grevenier all mess detector and this is your inert gas system repeater the main unit is in the ccr and this is your boiler panel alboc boiler and this is your repeater for fire alarm system this is the mic for public address so in case of emergency you can make the announcement just by pressing this this is the power system mode lamp and buzzer test indication for dc emergency and main power source two sets of phone one is auto one is sound power this is the telegraph lever right now the engine is running in full ahead and this is the fuel control lever this is the indication panel for main engine right now it is in bridge control you can see here this is the buzzer and flicker stop for any alarm emergency stop for fuel oil number 1 and number 2 this is the alpha lubricator and this is the alarm list for alpha lubricator so this is the one which is showing the rpm you can press this button to show the percentage mark indicator fuel mark indicator and this is the pressure temperature right now your number 2 pump is running this is fire alarm panel you can break the glass and activate the fire alarm manual call point and this is general emergency alarm two modes are there auto and manual these are the push button to start your pack dc matlab vcr ac generator do booster pump main air compressors auxiliary boiler if they are running they will indicate and these are the emergency stops we have one alarm lock printer over here this your fuel stick is very important this is the exit door 
EBD, your work plan board, and your Ganpati Bappa. This side I have already shown you, and one more exit door to over that side. And these are the two glasses to view outside your uh, control room.